I'm going to show you how to use the fax feature on your Ring Central application. So, first thing you need to do is either use the app installed on your computer or go to app.ringcentral.com. So, I'm on the web version right now. That's what I tend to use. Up here on the right, I'm sorry, top left hand side, you'll see phone, text, message, video, context, workspace. Yours may be in a different order. That was one of the options where you could customize it by clicking the more. All you need to do is find fax. So find the fax button, click on that. You'll be taken to your greeting screen. These are any faxes that have come in or any of your details. I am going to send one. So I go up here to the plus button, send a new fax. I'll click that. Enter in the phone number that you're going to send it to. I'm going to send it back to me. You can choose a cover page. So clicking this drop down gives you all these to look through. You can choose which one, doesn't really matter, whatever is to your liking. Any additional notes that you may have. And then you're going to drag and drop the actual files that you want to fax. So all I need to do is open up my folder view, find the file that I want to add. So I'm going to go to my desktop and I have the district calendar there. So I'm just going to, so I'm going to drag that over. So I'm going to move this over here, drag that document into that box and I'm going to let go. So it is uploaded there and then I'm going to click send now. Fax submitted. Over here on the left hand side, you'll see it's processing. And if I click on my name, I can get more information. And here it says submitted two pages. That would be my cover page and the document that I sent. Because I sent it to myself, I'll be able to see it right here. Hit the eyeball to view it. There's my cover page and there's my fax. So it's pretty simple to do. All you're doing is hitting the plus button here, set a fax. Choose the number that you're going to send it to, any additional notes, drag your file into this box and hit send now. It does take a little while, so don't be surprised if it takes some time. It's got to upload and then send. But then all you need to do is when you're looking at it, you can go to the unread, which I won't have any, but go to the all, go over to where it says when it was submitted to this little eyeball right here. When you hover on it, it says view, click it, and you'll be able to view those faxes.